happening now? Michigan Tech University students are on campus again, and today marked the first day of fall classes. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Colin Jackson was there. He's on campus to speak with students about their first day and their academic goals. Thousands of students moved across Michigan Tech University's campus for their first day of classes today. Some explored or hung out with their friends, while others headed to or exited their classes. Wisconsin-born Olivia Capelli is one of these students. Following an internship in Stevens Point, she's back to continue her education in biomedical engineering. I actually just got out of a signals and systems class that um, we're going to work on taking signals from EKGs and transmitting them into a format that you can look at and actually analyze. Other students are interested in electrical engineering, such as Ben Penix. This summer, he took part in an internship at an airport. After gaining hands-on experience, he is looking to go into a career of aviation development. Specifically, military planes is something I've been interested in, thinking about weapons on those and things like that, but I'm not picky right now. I just learned that I really like the developmental side of it. Still others are not at MTU for technology or engineering focused careers. Perry Meslow is aiming to get a history degree before going to law school, but he says law school is not his only option. It gives me a little bit more wiggle room if I want to pursue something in government or if I don't just want to go to law school. These and the many other students on campus mean a boost in customers at businesses in the area. Roy's Pasties and Bakery, for example, frequently receives orders and purchases from students and even their families. Throughout the year, parents are calling in for deliveries to their students to our business, and so um, it's a huge benefit to us. Nari also says students use the bakery as a meetup or study area for their schoolwork. When not in classes, students will also have the opportunity to participate participate in several campus activities as part of Welcome Week. Colin Jackson, TV6 News, Houghton.